another evening, another job. Um, I received the lights through the post the other day for the outside, some up down lights in black. Um, got these from Amazon. Uh, I'll pop some links down below to those. They, we saw them in a local DIY store, um, like the quality. Hopefully they won't rust, that is, uh, that's the dream. We're gonna put them up either side of the garage. I'll take you outside now and show you where. So what I'm gonna do tonight is I wanna get the lights mounted, understood where I need them. Um, in fact, we'll go outside and I'll, I'll talk you through it. So what I'm behind here is an up and down light on each, each pillar behind me, as you can see. And um, so I've got a few jobs to do. I need to move that drain pipe over. I need to remove that. I need to remove that light. And um, yeah, it should should look pretty good. So if I give you a bit of an overview, so, as you can see, we'll have a light there. We'll move that over. Um, luckily, I can flip that great thing around and uh, get that on a 45 degree down, straight down there. So we can have a light there. We can have one there, we can have one there, and then I'll remove the other. Uh, all black, up and down lights. I'll grab one and I'll show you what uh, what they look like. So this is what we've got. It's called the Nordlux Tim Maxi. And it's just gonna sit on the wall. Like that. Look quite neat, I think. So let's crack yeah. on and uh, get these mounted. Might look at running some cables today, but um, I don't think I've got enough cables, so we'll, uh, we'll see how these operate. So we'll get this base fitted, mounted to the wall, pretty steady job. Bit awkward with the stone, um, but yeah, we'll get this mounted and uh, take it from there. So what I've had to do is drill at an angle. I like to think it were precision, but it weren't. I wanted it to come here ideally, but there's good. Because what I can do is send the cable parallel with this, behind capping up and beyond. Show you. I don't know if you can see it there. So yeah, happy with that. And then outside, got a drill bit there, through there, and then just need to chip away at these bits just so uh, the mount is flush. So easy as that. So how I'm going to control these is with this. It's a photocellite uh, timer, and what it does is it replaces a normal photocell. You can pull this this off. Oh, it's too hard. Um, yeah, there we go. And it replaces it. So what happens is, it gets dusk, lights come on. You set a time on there. Where is it? Can't remember where it is. Oh, on the underneath there, as you can see. So I'll have these to go off at like. 11 o'clock something like that um, or you can leave them so they just stay on all night it's up to you uh, and go off when it comes light again but for me I'd rather get them switched off and um, yeah so they're just on evening and um, all control through that so pretty good bit of kit 14 pound off eBay I'll pop a link below as well right so day two and back from work I'm gonna move this drain pipe you can see I've got two up now just want to finalize that they sort of mocked up ready for um, uh, for getting cables in and stuff so i want to get that third one done i've got all my bits here i'll uh, i'll show I've you been there. got some light bulbs and got the drain pipe bit so that's a shoe for the bottom and then we've got the i think they're 112.5 degree angles and then cable so we'll get them up this one's done 
we'll have to tidy that up, but there was a letterbox there. I can get the third one up. I'm all finished tonight, so let's, uh, let's crack on. Drain pound moved over, made way for the light, just ran some cable. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna start running cable. I'm gonna hide the uh, microfield signal, green dots there. That's for the light sensor, that's gonna go up there, and then it's gonna be controlled off a switch in the very messy garage just there. So, yeah, so I'm gonna. Get the cables right. Ran. We can uh, make some progress now. Cabling, it's easy, just fiddly. So um, yeah, we'll see how we get on with that. Um, but it shouldn't be too bad, fingers crossed. So um, I'm gonna crack on with that and uh, let's try and time up. Fast forward a few days and um, the lights are done. It, it's proving pretty difficult to um, to time lapse, you know, running cables and stuff. So you're here, there, and everywhere in a short space of time. But we did it. Um, I'm going to put some uh, footage now of them complete, um, and then when it gets dark later on, I'll get outside and show you the finished article. It does look pretty good. You might have already seen it on Instagram. Um, you, everyone seemed to love it so yeah i do it's transformed the uh, exterior of the house um, but also got its practical element so just gives us some light on an evening uh, and then turn off at night to save some money so so yeah thanks for watching uh, i'll link everything down below uh, that i've used the timer and and things like that and the lights um, and i'll also link the instagram page so go over check that out if you haven't already and uh, Please follow us and uh, make sure you like and subscribe. Cheers.